What's up YouTube? Welcome back to Become The Music. My name is Gary. Thank you for joining me tonight. I'm very excited to check out something that I think is going to be very interesting. This randomly popped up in my feed the other day and I was like, that looks really cool. So what this is, is a collaboration between a Dutch DJ and producer named Umet Ozkan. He's of Turkish extraction. Um, he's an electronic musician, DJ, producer, that kind of stuff, and a Siberian band called Otukien, Otukien, something like that, Siberian indigenous music group, mixes elements of modern pop with local folk music. That's really cool to me because I've mentioned this in another video somewhere along the line, but uh, I'm a big traveler and when I travel to, you know, foreign countries, I always go to a record store and I say, I want two things. I want whatever the, the, the current heavy music is from your country. Give me like a heavy metal band or a you know, hard rock band, whatever that, that people like. And give me music that your grandpa listened to or what, you know, whatever. Like, so what I want is tra I like traditional music from, from other countries and kind of modern heavy stuff. So I like to check out, you know, indigenous music from other, other areas. Um, I'm also indigenous and I like to hear my own culture's music coming up, like um, Tanya Tagak and um, uh, the Halusi Nation, if you know these bands. Anyways, they're, you know, Canadian indigenous artists. But uh, so I'm really kind of quite excited to, to check this out. And the song that we're looking at is called Alte or Alte. So this is Umet Ozkan and Otukian with Alte. Let's hit it. Wow, heavy. Throat singing. Wow. Just gonna pause here for a second. Aside from that, that this is actually blowing my mind already. It's incredible music. The costumes, um, it's really interesting how close a lot of this, these looks are, the costumes, the makeup, the jewelry, whatever, from Siberia to Canadian and North American indigenous peoples. I mean, it makes sense because you know, go back in history, the, the North American indigenous people came across the Siberian land bridge, right? So they came from this, which so I could actually be say right now that I'm looking back 100,000 years into my my history or whatever. This is really awesome. Yeah, turquoise and stuff. Yeah. So some modern elements there. Traditional instruments and modern elements. Just gonna pause again, sorry. A personal thing, the first instrument I ever played in my life was a jaw harp. She's playing one right here. This guy's hardcore. That voice is fantastic.
some heavy guitars in there too. Really has that tribal thing going on that I love. This is killer. Wow. Change of scene. Wow. That was amazing. Amazing. I would love to see this live. Um, that's like, it's, it's spiritual, if you want to use that word. It's spiritual. It really has that vibe to it. It's very tribal. Very, very, very good stuff. Wow, am I glad I checked that out. Thank you, YouTube algorithm, for dropping that in my suggested videos. Um, yeah, not much frame of reference for that. You know, it's, it's really different but so interesting. Um, I'm gonna check out both of these artists some more um, to see who brought what to the table in this collaboration here. So Umet Ozkan and o Otukian, Otukian, right? That's how it's pronounced, Otukian, according to Wikipedia. So drop some comments below. Have you seen this before? Do you like this kind of music? Um, what do you think? Like, cause that's, you know, that's stepping far outside the bounds of like, you know, Western pop music or whatever. Um, which is one of the things I, that I enjoy about doing on this channel is because I grew up on classic rock and heavy rock and stuff like that. I don't do much of that type of music on this channel because I've heard it all and it's not a reaction. The only time I do it is if I want to you know, prop up an artist that I think deserves some recognition or, I'm, or I want people to, wow, you got to hear this band because they're killer and they were overlooked or whatever. Um, but, you know, most reaction channels, they're going to do Deep Purple and, you know, Judas Priest and whatever because it's the first time they've heard these bands and fair enough, great, get on with it. But I grew up on that stuff, so it's not, to me, it's not a reaction. It's like, yeah, I've heard this already. So, but this kind of stuff is where I really dig doing reactions because it's like man i would never have discovered this before if i hadn't had youtube suggesting this kind of stuff because of my searches for the channel right so you can probably tell i'm really excited that was great i i loved everything about that um very very cool awesome stuff awesome stuff and yeah as i say really interesting you know as, as a first nations person knowing what you know some of the stuff in my culture is to see the parallels in the costumes and some of the music approach and a little bit of that kind of thing. So yeah, that's, that's really cool. That's really awesome. Thank you for joining me on this musical journey, which it really was right. And uh, yeah, drop some comments below. Let me know what you think. And um, I will bid you adieu and have a wonderful evening. Take care.